Hey, good morning, tech fans. Welcome back once again to Tech of Tomorrow. I'm Eric, your host, and we've got a lot of really cool stuff on Sunday's plate. First up in the news, for AMD fans, excellent news going on right now. Now, you guys all know about the pile driver technology. Well, check it out. The FX 6300 and the FX 4300 are being replaced. That's right. Now, what's going on is you're getting more clock speed but you're also getting a little bit more in your tdp as well so what's going on so check it out six core release the new fx 6350 is hitting the market as a six core process from amd clocked at 3.9 gigahertz has a boost speed of 4.3 gigahertz that's right then they're also releasing a four core cpu this is the new fx 4350 this one is also clocked at 3.9 gigahertz and has 4.2 two for its boost speed respectively so check that out that stuff coming at the market and what the really cool thing about this is is that even though these things are getting replaced well actually they're actually replacing the other ones is what i mean even though these ones are coming to market and they're replacing the other cpus the price isn't going to change so currently right now if you were out in the market and you're looking for something and you looked up an fx 6300 it would be 132 dollars you can now get the 6350 for $132 and the FX4350 for $122. So that's really cool news. I know you AMD fans out there are going to be like going, hell yeah, rock on. Now, the only trade-off of that is you do get 30 more watts of TDP, which means the thing's going to run a little bit hotter. So you're going to have to use some little bit better cooling. But most people nowadays are going to use water cooling and take care of their Shiznik anyways. Now, for people out there who like Intel stuff, there's a whole new thing going on there. The Chromebook is going to be released with the Haswell chip inside of it. That's right. So you're going to get better graphics because you know that the graphics on the new Haswell are supposed to be a lot better than the ones on Haswell, at least 30 to 40 percent better from what rumors have stated. And you're also going to get extended battery life. So you get better graphics, extended battery life, better performance, and obviously if you get a Chromebook and it's gonna have that awesome pixel density screen, you're gonna get the most amazing screen plus all the Haswell goodies all in one. Okay, so that's the news stories. Now, check it out, folks. You guys all know that we had the 100K contest and we have a winner, and that system is the new Rosewill Silent Killer. That's right. Why do we call this thing the Silent Killer? Well, for one thing, it's totally, utterly quiet. Even when the system's up and running, this thing is silent. So let's make sure we thank all the right people and let's check out the system. First off, we're gonna thank Rosewolf, their R5 case. You guys can do this right off the bat on the outside. We're also using one of their capstone power supplies. We're using the Gigabyte F2AX85-UP4 motherboard. As far as the APU goes, we use the AMD. Now, this bad boy is the A105800K. You guys all know that one. We're also using a video card from the people over at XFX. So you wanna make sure we thank those people properly as well. Now, we also wanna send special thanks out to Kingston. They provided two of their HyperX SSDs. These are two of their 128 gigabyte drives. Also, thanks to the people over at SuperTalon who provided the 64 gigabyte PCIe SSD. All cool stuff. Now, you guys can see the system's been totally built up. Our tech, Anthony Reynolds, took care of this bad boy. It looks really, really good. You can see there's custom fans on the front, custom fans on top. We're gonna open it all up now. You guys can see inside totally of the system are all the parts that we talked about, the motherboard, the CPU. Also, special thanks out to the people at Corsair. Thank you very much for your water cooler. We're using their 55 in there. This thing's working really, really good in this system. You guys can see the video card inside of here. You guys can see there's some custom lighting and everything. Also, you guys can see the system's up totally up and running and it's completely quiet. Thanks to Bill Owen over at mnpctech.com for providing these totally cool little feet on here. These things come from his website. Thank you very much. Props to that guy. He provided them for us and we are providing them to you, the winner. Last but not least, you don't want to forget anybody. Thanks to Mushkin for providing eight gigabytes of DDR3 memory. This stuff is just the 1333 stuff, but it runs totally stable and is just perfect for gaming, which is actually what this system's totally geared for. It'll play every game that there is at 1920 by 1080 and will have no hiccups at all with the bells and whistles turned up and going.
So all right, folks, so there you go, the silent killer system. And I just want to reiterate, you know, folks, that we've already announced the 100K winners. Now, for some reason, you were up, you know, skydiving in space, jumping off, doing, you know, one of those crazy commercials or something, you happened to miss it. Well, hey, we announced all the winners, and there'll be a link down underneath that like button in the description where you guys can check that out. And while you're down there, just make sure you hit that button as well. You know, you know, you know what's up. And so now check it out. We also have another product we're going to be taking a look at today. These are the new Mez 11 Classic In-Ear Headphones. Now, if you guys don't know Mez, Anthony Mez is a guy who designs all kinds of cool headphones, all based on ebony wood and just really exotic rare woods, which gives everything not only a unique look, everything has a totally unique sound, and best of all, no two pairs are alike. Now, I think these things are coming to market at about $79 right now. That's, what, that's what's going on. They're coming to market at about $79. Now let's talk about the product specifications of these Mez 11 Classics. Speaker size, eight millimeter neodymium. The frequency response is from 16 Hertz to 24 kilohertz. Sensitivity, 101 plus to two dB. Impedance, 14 ohms. Rated input power is three milliwatts and it has a 3.5 millimeter gold plated plug. Now, with that said, I've got those right here behind me and we're gonna do the unboxing of them. So there's not a lot to see with this folks. So I'm just gonna bring them up here so the camera can just do a zoomy zoomy. We'll have a lot of B-roll and stuff for you folks so you can check them out, but here's the front. Here's the back. And then we're going to come over here and we'll go ahead and take them out of the box. So, all right, folks. So we've got them down the little table here. You see it's got a nice, simple little thing just like hangs on a little rack right there. Flip it around the back. Open up the little Punisher knife. Go ahead and make a quick insertion here. Get the product out of the box. Go ahead and take that and nab it at you folks. Get that out of the way. Go ahead and open up the box right here. Pop the little tab here. Try not to be too destructive in my tab popping. Sometimes I get a little... Uh, anxious with my unboxings and tear the product, but there we go. I've got them. So we're going to go ahead and take that out You guys can see that for anybody who missed it like here's the back of the box If you're really interested in that just says the Mez 11 classics with mic It's got a microphone on it too as well So if you want to use it as a gaming or jogging or telephoning or anything like that, you'll be able to do that So let's get that out of the way. So right at the back you see you get a little carrying case the little Mez logo on there Go ahead and open it up. Now inside, on one side, we have little things for your ear pads. Also get a carabiner. Oh, that's pretty interesting. So check that out. We actually get a carabiner inside of there. Try to get that out of there without tearing it. But there's actually no way to. So I'm just going to do it quick and dirty and just tear it and get the dang thing out. Check out. You get a carabiner right there, which is kind of cool. You can carry it around with you if you're out backpacking or whatever. You want to slap that bad boy on something and not lose it. That will come in handy. You also have additional little ear pads and ear buffs. And then we come to the product itself. You can see a little thing in there to capture everything. Then we come to the product itself. Let me go ahead and take this out of its bag. Try to keep the bag, you know, as pristine as possible. So if I want to restore them, I can. But what the heck. Who's fooling anybody? I'm just going to tear that and get it out of there. All right. Be done with it. So here we go. Got a little thing here all wrapped up and keeping everything nice and safe so that uh, I can't uh, get it out for you guys. But let's try to get this little thing out of here. See the total product. La da 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 da. All right. There we go. There we go. All right. Let's get it out of there. So let's start off with right here. Gold plated. We go down right here. Here is the microphone. It's got the little Mez logo on it as well. Here is the controller right here. It's kind of hard to see. It's very, very small, but it's there. And then we have the two Mez. And then I guess I'll just set these down here so you guys can get a closer look of the camera and super zoom in on here. Now these things are made totally of a rare wood. Like I said, no two are alike. They're very, very beautiful. And let me go ahead and stick them in my ear and see how they feel. Do you guys want to hear it?
don't know if you guys can hear that very well, but hey, it's an experimentation in motion, and I'm hoping you guys might be able to hear it. I've got it turned up pretty much full blast on there, as you guys saw, off the Samsung uh, Galaxy S3 there, blazing it up. Um, and I gotta say, they actually sound pretty good. Let me take one more listen quick. Now, one thing I gotta say about these, I feel deep bass in them, and there's good treble in them as well. The camera's looking at me like, dude, shut up, talk lower, but it's hard. These things actually are really incredible thing. Anthony, you did a good job on these bastards. They really rock. Yeah, for in-ear headphones, these things are pretty rocking. With the $70 price tag, I gotta say, they're worth it. This, these things sound cool. I wish I could reproduce it for all you guys to hear. I hope I did. Cool stuff though, sounds really good. Sorry folks, now before we blaze out and get out of here for the day, check it out. I've got an incredible deal of the day. You guys are really gonna dig this one, I'm telling you, this is a really incredible deal. Check it out. Seagate, three terabyte Barracuda drive, on sale for 119. This is 60% off right now on this drive on Amazon. You've got a couple days to jump in and get this thing. Might be going on for a little bit longer. I know for Prime members, it says you can get this thing shipped and if I bought it today, I could actually have it here by Monday, which is pretty damn incredible. But if you guys are into Seagate, you guys love the terabyte drive, three terabytes, 119 bucks. I mean, how the hell are you gonna beat that? Also, if you wanna get one that's used, they have used refurbished ones that are 62 to 63% off. Just a few more little nodgins there. But that's it, folks. So check it out, man. We got all that really cool stuff. The brand new FX, 4350, 6350 processors, Chromebooks with Haswell inside of it, the 100K silent killer system going out to our winner, Iggy Castiller, our winner out there, whatever the heck I said back there, I don't know, but our winner. So like everything will be down in there below the like button in the description. Everything that we've said will be there. Also, while you guys are down there, make sure you guys hit that like button, showing us that you appreciate it. These are all cool stories. And I think the system's pretty cool for our winner. And uh, go check out the other video and check out the links and make sure that you're not a winner. You didn't claim your prize because if you are, you're really missing out. So I'm Elric. Thanks for watching Tech of Tomorrow. If you're not subscribed, make sure you do so because we have lots of cool stuff still happening here on Tech of Tomorrow. See ya.